Hello everybody and welcome to the vlog that we've been waiting for, which is the uh, PC vlog. Here is the new PC. Now what's really cool, you know what I should do before I do anything, is show you a uh, size comparison of the old one compared to it. That would be kind of cool, right? Let's do that. Pull this over here. Push this guy over to yaw, like so. There's the size difference. <laughs> uh, that's the uh, G uh, G27 pedals. Everything's a mess right now. I'm getting everything all set, you know. Um, as so, but here is the difference in size. Compare. Don't pay attention to the mess over here. Again, I'm just moving everything around. Um, I took the side panel off just uh, to show off the computer. No, no other reasons. Um, so we can get this old dinosaur out of here. This one is going to my father, so he'll have a better PC. Um, uh, so he can play FSX with me and uh, and all that. He's got a really old dinosaur. Actually, has my old PC, old PC. <laughs> but let's get started here. This is the Cooler Master uh, Stormtrooper, which is a fantastic case. This is options to turn off your lights. So I can turn the lights off on the uh, fans if I want. Turn them back on, like so. Um, also, we have fan control in real time. We can turn it down all the way. Like so, and you can barely hear running up there, like so, and we can turn it back up, like so, and you can see there it goes a little bit faster, a little bit cooler, um, so really need to have that interface on there. Uh, here's our two fans on the side, as you can see, uh, and behind those, what you can see right there, behind there, just hiding, uh, that's one of the uh, Seagate Barracudas, there are two of them, one terabyte on top. One terabyte on the bottom. The first terabyte is for uh, Windows 7 and uh, games and stuff. Uh, the second terabyte is just going to be for uh, recording. Just for uh, fraps to record and, and, and encoding to. I'm also going to put FSX on there for now. Um, until I get a third one and then I'm going to put... Uh, I uncoded the third one instead of the one that FSX is going to be on. But um, as you can see, let's move over here to the bottom. What's powering this bad boy is a... EVGA Supernova, as you can see, the G2, or the 1000 G2, that is um, 1,000 watts of straight power, 80 plus gold at that. Um, and uh, Zach, he did a fantastic job on the build. Um, let's try to bring the, the light over here a little bit better so you can see a little bit more inside. Um, you can see all the way up there, like he just really ran these wires, um, really, really fantastic. It's really clean, as you can see. Um, we did go with the uh, EVGA GeForce GTX 660 card, um, uh, as shown there. This guy right here is amazing, okay? <laughs> I have never thought in my life I would have uh, water cooling uh, in a PC, and, the, and that's what we have. We have a liquid cooling by Corsair there, and it runs around into the back where that fan is, and it's, you know, sort of the radiator. I call it the radiator. I don't know what the technical term is for that. Um, but as you can see, here's the MSI board, uh, AM3 CPU support, as uh, as you can uh, you can tell right there what it says. Uh, we went with the Corsair Vengeance um, DDR3 RAM. That's 16 gigabytes in there. Um, so with that and the GTX uh, 660 at two gigabytes, we've got some power. I mean, <laughs> we've we've got a lot of power. I can't uh, can't uh, say enough. One thing I did want to say um, is. Uh, what caused this build to be so cheap, uh, not, ch I, w I don't call cheap, I don't call $955 cheap uh, by any means, but for what I got, um, absolutely amazing. Uh, mainly because I have to really thank Chris Davidson, uh, or may do you call it Dave David Davidson? But I would say Davidson. <laughs> we have to thank him for the uh, AMD FX8320 processor in there. Uh, that he donated. He uh, he had one that was just slightly used, and uh, he sent it over to Zach so we could throw it in there. So just a massive help there. I didn't have to buy a uh, processor. That was that was the most amazing thing <laughs> right off the bat. Uh, continuing along, uh, I don't know what else what else do we have to say. In I mean it pretty much shows itself. Let me show you the back side of it so that you can see that. Um, here's the. Uh, Let's put some light on this sucker back here, like so. Uh, you can see how I have everything just kind of set in here for now. Um, there's the uh, back of the, the motherboard. Whoop. There she is. Yeah, I'm a, the motherboard. 
Uh, and then uh, we've got HDMI for the main P PC's uh, monitor, my HDTV. And then I've got the uh, old VGA for the old crappy one on the side that we use for uh, live streams and, and I use for Skype and all that good stuff. So, uh, really, really, really amazing PC. Um, I haven't got to play any games on it yet, but as you can see, I do have NASCAR installed. I'm getting ready to uh, record that. Um, on here. I'm really excited about that. I just got to hook the wheel up and that's essentially it. Um, before I get into uh, the rest of uh, what I want to in this vlog, uh, I wanted to say uh, that we had, when this thing arrived yesterday, we had a bitch of a time. <laughs> Mainly because I cannot stress how much, look at the size of that friggin' fan in there. I believe it's like 120 millimeters or something like that. I think that's exactly what he told me, but it's just massive. And then you have a slide out. Um, uh, you have a, I could slide out the uh, filter on the top there for uh, the air filter for it. Um, when this showed up, we got had everything all hooked up and everything. It would not fire up. It would not start. Um, so we were like, oh, you gotta be kidding me. I mean, as you can see, it's funny, <laughs> look at the wires down here, I know. Um, but back there, we only have those two, uh, prongs in the outlet, and we have to use, uh, little adapter supports for those. And I know, um, and maybe you firefighters are probably like, oh my god, it's an accident waiting to happen. Um, it's just a mess right now, because, uh, I was just testing a lot of different shit. Uh, it's, it doesn't normally look like that, so, <laughs> um... Yeah, we don't have the three prongs. So we were thinking it was something to do with a grounding issue. I mean, it was really hard to figure it out. Uh, so we took it. I took it into the living or into the uh, kitchen, and uh, my roommate Dave, um, he he he's built PCs and, and he knows a lot about PCs. So we were taking it off and looking, and we took the whole top of this guy off to expose the circuitry board on here because we had a hunch. Well, I didn't have a hunch. That was Alex. Uh, Alex is in the no the northern Alex. Um, had a hunch that it could have been, because I said, oh, the, the, the power button kind of seems janky. It wasn't really pushing down all the way. Uh, and that's what the problem was. We took that off. Um, it just needed to be reset in there. Uh, or that didn't need to be reset. The whole top needed to reset. So we put it back on there. We're like, man, it's just not making that connection. So it's right here, as you can see. This was like a quarter inch off, just straight up. And uh, that's what it was doing. So... <laughs> Once we had that snap down in there, press the button, wham, she just lit up. And um, what a hell of a PC this thing is. This is going to be, this is more than an, uh, than enough of a PC for me. Uh, I won't have to upgrade it. You can see the, um, the motherboard is fully upgradable. If I want to, uh, I can go with uh, 32 gigabytes of RAM, which I plan on doing. Um, and I don't really need that much RAM for gaming and all that. Well, I mean, at least not now. Uh, but for editing and all that good stuff, uh, I do I do need that. So, uh, uh, just absolutely fantastic. Um, fantastic uh, PC. I'm, I'm extremely happy with this thing. <laughs> I'm like, I was like Christmas yesterday when this thing showed up. I was like, oh my god. Um, but very fast, I just want to thank all of the donators that donated towards this. I know 955 was, uh, I, I had set a goal of $1,000, but that wasn't, um, for, um, uh, for, like, all donations. That was just for, you know, uh, I, I figured I was going to throw a couple hundred bucks in or, you know, or, you know, whatever, um, and make the sacrifice because if, because this thing here, when it was done... It was done, and my channel would suffer greatly from that. I wouldn't be able to put out content for you guys uh, for a very long time until I would have had the money to uh, finally get a new PC, and it probably would have been a hell of a lot less of a PC than this massive uh, beast here. So just very fast, I really want to thank um, the, you guys, the top donators, um, the ones that really made this happen. Uh, you know, every little bit count, and every one of you counted. Uh, and I kept track of every one of you that uh, did donate. Um, I kind of wanted to have like a little bit of a chart to show you what you bought and all that stuff. But I figured I just would tell everybody um, thank you and, and, and tell, tell you the reasons why I say thank you. Um, the top donators, the ones that really donate a lot of money right off the bat, really got this ball rolling. I could order parts. Uh, Patrick, uh, known as Augzrilla. Dude, you are, you have been like the most, one of the most supportive people and you've helped so much. 
Um, and I know it, that you were just like, ah, it's not that big of a deal. But to me, like, this is a PC I thought I would never, ever have in, in, in my household. Um, James Johnson, man, thank you so much. Um, I wish I knew your guys' screen names. I would say them, but I'm just probably saying your real name instead because that's all the info I had. So, James, thank you, man, so much. And Isaac, Isaac Solis, um, you again, you know, you, you not only on Steam, you help me on Steam. He, he, he buys me a lot of games on Steam, and Augsrilla does too, uh, Pat. Um, on Steam, like, because I'll be like, oh, I got to wait, you know, uh, I got to wait a, a week or whatever for, um, for the, uh, for, to get another, another game that I want to get, and, uh, here's my current library, as we can see here, we've got, uh, all the Armas, Assetto Corsa, that was, uh, Bugs bought me that for, uh, my birthday, so I recently got that Assetto Corsa, uh, you know, Car Mechanic Simulator, all that, Chivalry, Contagion, Dead Island, um, Epidemic, uh, Driver San Francisco, uh, Euro Truck Simulator 2, I've got, you know, I've got tons of games in here, F1 2013, Cannot wait. Oh, I need to install. Why wasn't I installing that? Well, let's install that. Some bitch. Some bitch need to install that one. There we go. Work. Work while we're doing work. All right, cool. NASCAR 14, obviously. Um, these are the ones I, I've got. You know, Train Simulator for 2014, Take on Helicopter. You know all those. Uh, I do have next car game, and you will see some videos of that soon. Uh, I couldn't run it on the old PC, uh, pure and simple. So that is the reason behind that. Um... Let's see here. Oh, I wanted to show you this. This uh, is a microphone arm stand. I finally got one of these. Uh, this is this little cheapy piece of shit one off of Amazon for thirty nine ninety nine, um, and it had you know mixed reviews. I, look at the shit everywhere. I know, guys, <laughs> it's a mess. But it's it's not a bad uh, microphone arm. It's AGP Tech, um, whoever that is. I don't know. I use the default. Um, the one that came with it, that uh, um, uh, shock mount. God, I couldn't think of the damn word. Yeah, the shock mount uh, for that. Um, but it, it's it's actually of pretty decent quality, um, and it it's it's pretty sturdy. It's pretty nice. I I really like it way more than that boom stand I had. That's for damn sure. Um, so continuing on, uh, you know Isaac and Patrick, you guys helped me so much with the uh, Steam. Um, I wanted to continue on to say thank you to Frugal Frugal Sim. Uh, Pete, you're amazing, dude. Um, he he donated as well. Uh, that really, you know, that's it, it's just amazing that you know all these people came together, and that's kind of why I call this your guys' PC. It's not it's not really my PC. Um, it's it's you know you guys paid for it, and uh, you guys are the reason why uh, you're gonna have the uh, content that you you will have coming out. Um, so we're just gonna try to get through these guys uh, as many as possible. Um, Alex Smith, thank you so much, man. Uh, Digitala Productor, Digitala Producta. I don't know how you say that name completely. Uh, Michael Artel, uh, Nathan Workman, uh, Rob Rawlinson. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna butcher this one. I'm sorry, man. Uh, Zan Skolser. I don't know if that's correct. Uh, Ye Ye Xavier, Xavier Vasquez. <laughs> I sound like an idiot. Uh, Kyle Hastings. Uh, buy a block advertisements. Um, uh, Lane Firenbrook, uh, Blessing Cherry and man, thank you so much. Uh, James DeMeo, uh, Zach Bailey, Bethel Labs, Bethel Lab Studios. Thank you for your continued support. I know you're a super fan, bro. Um, Fried Golden, Fried. I'm a. Oh my god, I knew I was gonna fuck something up. Uh, Fred, Fred Golden, um, Bernie Revering, Philip Hibbard, Alexander Kazora. Uh, Jorge, I think it's Jorge Harleman. Uh, Larry, I call you Larry 66 Morgan. Um, right down the road from me, right down uh, out that way, down 44, or not 44, but uh, 70 off towards Kansas City. That way, Larry, thank you so much uh, for your donation. Uh, Donald Corrigan, uh, Lewis Potter, uh, George Jones, and what a cool name that is, George, uh, if that is your actual name. Well, I think it is, it has to be uh, George Jones. Uh, BCPD. Uh, Lewis, I already said Lewis Potter, uh, Mac, Mac, Matt McCluggage, um, you know, these are just all the ones that I could write down right away, uh, and all you guys that donated, um, amazing, I mean, here it is, <laughs> it's here in the house, and I have everything pretty much back to normal, uh, one thing I didn't get is a DVD drive, I'll probably buy one of those, um, a little later on, what sucks about that is, FSX is a DVD, 
So I'm gonna have to find out a way. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna like get the DVD uh, copied onto my one of my externals and uh, and see if it installs from there. It it might do that. I don't know. I can maybe make, make an ISO image of it. Maybe I'll do that um, because I have my CD key in there, which I'm not gonna show you obviously, but uh, the the CD key inside of there, um, and it should just activate as such. But um, I got to get that installed. Um, Another thing is GTA 4. I'm actually getting ready. I got to buy that on Steam, uh, GTA 4. So that, um, oh, I had like a little bit of late uh, donations come in. And those of you guys who came with the late donations, that, that money goes all towards uh, the channel. Uh, it's going into uh, the, uh, uh, like, Grand Theft Auto 4 for, uh, <laughs> for Steam. So I, have, I can actually play that and get LCPDFR going again for you guys. Um, but, you know, I, I'm sorry. I, I'm I don't have very many good angles to show. I mean, other than just, let's just have a final look at this amazing machine. And I'm gonna zoom in so we can see it all. God, those heat sinks, bro. 16 gigabytes of RAM, my God. I, and I upgraded from eight gigabytes. So, and 32, astronomical to me. Like, it's just, it's gorgeous. It's the most beautiful thing I have most beautiful PC I've ever seen, and it's it's here in the house. I'm I'm just blown away, guys. Uh, and thank you uh, for your continued support uh, with the channel and Code Zero. Um, you know, with this machine, we are going to be doing a hell of a lot. We're going to be doing live streams on the weekends. Um, we're going to be live streaming a lot more, actually. Uh, uh, videos won't be a problem with FSX and in games that'll actually I can record now uh, F1 2013 and and continue those series. So really excited to get um, uh, on on there and and get to work. Uh, that's what I want to do. So I'm not gonna uh, bother with you guys any any more than this. But uh, there she is. She is here. She runs. And my God, is it beautiful? My God, is it beautiful? The stormtrooper. You know, in the stormtrooper, this case, uh, uh, Pete, uh, Frugal, Frugal Sim, he's got uh, the exact one over there. And some of you guys uh, may be new to um, my channel. Uh, go check out Frugal Sim. Um, uh, Frugal, F R O O G L E Sim, all one word. Go check his videos out. He does. Uh, he, he can. He's probably got a video for all the questions I get asked in FSX. So have a look over there if you if you haven't already. Um, that's the place to look because he's the expert, and I certainly am not. So. Okay, I've I, we've, we've seen the PC enough, I think, right? <laughs> um, I look forward to doing some more vlogs with you guys and, uh, and, and videos to come this week. We're getting back in gear. Let's do this, guys. Uh, and uh, thank you so much. You guys are changing my life uh, one view at a time, essentially. <laughs> so amazing, guys. Thank you so much. Take care.